What is up, Poke Brothers and Sisters? My name is Brandon, aka Captain Muddy. Welcome to Captain Muddy Games. And in today's video, I'm opening up a Tapu Coco box. Now, I didn't know these were a thing. I was randomly at Walmart and I saw it for $15. So I picked up all three of them. There's a Tapu Coco, an Alolan Raichu, and a Marshadow box for 15 bucks. It does only come with three packs and a jumbo card and that promo right there. So we're also going to be opening up this loose Sword and Shield pack from a two pack blister that I opened earlier. But yeah, I'm guessing this is a Walmart Black Friday holiday exclusive. At the time of recording this, this is the day after Black Friday that I picked these up. I'm assuming there was one more because the, the whole area for, for these, there was one spot that was completely wiped out. So unfortunately, if there is a fourth one, I didn't get it and I'm probably not gonna get it, but yeah, we're gonna see. We're gonna see what kind of pull pull rates this has, and yeah, well, let's let's just dive into it and see. All right, what's going on, everybody? I hope you're having a lovely, lovely week. Pro this video is probably going up on Thursday. This will be my Thursday video, but I just thought this was so cool when I saw it. I couldn't believe actually my Walmart even had anything. They're usually completely picked clean. And if you if you want to see what I was talking about, head over to my Instagram. I posted a picture of the whole display that I found of these. And pretty much nobody wanted to touch the Tapu Coco. I'm only assuming a flipper or a scalper got to this because it's such a good deal. I mean, $15, oof, oof. They're doing it that way on these. That is terrible, terrible, terrible. Let's see if we can get this out without damaging the card too much. Although, you can see, this is a promo card, which is a pretty cool promo, but it's, uh, yeah, it's it, it's a little, little beat up, hopefully. Maybe we can do something about that later. But let's see. Okay. So you do get this lovely code card. Enjoy that. And in this one, you get Guardians Rising, Sun and Moon Base, and a Fates Collide. And here is that Jumbo Tapu Coco card, which let's, let's compare this to the old. Oh, look at that. It is just like... It is the same as the original Jumbo card, so that's kind of cool. Or kind of not if you're one of the people that puts these in a binder. I, myself, put them in frames. So we're going to start off. We're actually, we're going to start off with the Sword and Shield base. Maybe there's going to be something juicy in this one. Maybe, maybe not. We'll see. But who knows, maybe, maybe you're seeing these in stores and you're wondering what's inside of them maybe you just you want to know maybe just get a gift for your your children or grandchildren or whatever it may the case may be so this is sword and shield this did not come from the box though so kingler right on big charm minchino sobble blip bug ball toy hashtag Wulu Nation, Reverse Nicket, and a Cloister for the rare. All cards I do believe I do not need. So let's let's start it off with the Fates Collide. So this is the first pack of the Tapu Coco box. Oh, that that just was torn to sunder, wasn't it? Here is your code card if you want it. There's the first part of it, and the second, or the first part will be GW2. So I hope you all enjoy. And that was Fates Collide. Fates Collide is X and Y, right? I believe. We'll see. Starting off with a Dugong. 
Wigglytuff, Mega Catcher, Cottony, Bronzor, we got Seal, Snubble. I always like that that artwork of Snubble. It's just kind of like, hey, why, why are you bothering me? Finnekin, Reverse Spoink, hey, and a Del Fox holographic. That's a pretty cool holographic. Don't mind if I do, Del Fox. Definitely something I don't have. So we're going to set you right there. All right. Next up is Sun and Moon Guardians Rising. Can we get something more than a holographic would be great. So let's see. This is Sun and Moon, so the card trick is four to the front. Starting off with a Dark Energy. Mallow. Tentacruel. Ooh, Aether Paradise Conser Conservation Area. Wimpod. Wimpy, Wimpy, Wimpod. Jamo. Trubbish. Whalmer. Tallow. A Reverse. Go Gudar. Go Godar. Gudar. Gudar. Cardo. And hey, a rare holographic Absol. That's cool. Two holographics in this box. That's not bad. It's not bad for a holographic lower. I need I need more of those. Okay. This will be the last pack. Were these worth the $15? I mean, that depends on your opinion. If you like promo cards, then maybe. So here is your first glimpse and the first letters are ddh like i said let me know if that's working for you if not i'll do it a different way i'll try something else start off with an energy big malasada hypno pokeball sandile ratatat snubble that guy cutie fly a reverse holographic parasect, and that is a rare. And a crab bombable. Crab bombable. So no, no big hits in that that box, unfortunately. But you know, hey, that's how this. So after careful deliberation, I uh, I finished recording and everything. I even said my outro, but I. I I decided I'm going to open up the other two, especially because I got to get this information out there. Here is the receipt. These were only $7.58. Look at that. $7.48. $7 Sorry. Pokemon cards. If you see these, get them. They are not $15. They are only under $8. About seven fifty. So I'm going to go ahead and open up the Raichu and the Mars Shadow Box as well. So this may be a little bit of a longer video, and you may hear my 3D printer going in the background because it's literally an hour after I recorded the first box when I was sitting here and I realized that, and I said, "Oh my goodness, I gotta let people know. I gotta record." all three of these being open because they're so so cheap we're not going to bother with the raichu card just on stream wait a minute okay here you go here's that code card i guess it was in right there in that one so yet again you're gonna get oh look at that a roaring skies sun and moon guardians rising and burning shadows so some of these may be worth it. Here's the Jumbo Alolan Raichu card. Beautiful, beautiful card. So we're just going to go ahead and we're going to crack open both of these right here right now just to make things a little bit easier. I don't want to keep you too long. I appreciate those of you who, uh, who joined me. This box is different. The other ones weren't sealed sealed. This one was actually sealed trying to throw those and not hit my dog there's your Mars Shadow promo card and this one where's the code where's the code there's the code 
here is your code card and I will give away all the code cards from these so in this one you get breakthrough burning shadows and crimson invasion so we're gonna do the two XY's first oh let's not forget about the jump beautiful jumbo mar shadow card that will not fit fully on screen that is definitely going to get get a uh a nice little brain fart not a brain fart i'm having a brain fart oh my goodness um a picture frame oh my goodness sorry that wow wow okay so we're gonna start off with this roaring skies which i do believe is an older set let me see here um i'm not sure not sure i don't want to take up too much time trying to trying to find a date on these i know they are older they are xy series so here you go here is your code card enjoy that if you want roaring skies for the online so it's x and y so it's three to the front i believe so we got Dragonair on this, Electrode. These are cool. I've never opened up Roaring Skies. Rayquaza, let's see. 2000, 2015, wow. That's five years, these are five years old. Fletchling, Shuppet, Swablu, Wingull, Reverse Togepi, and an Altaria. That's a nice looking Altaria artwork. We're definitely going to be saving those cards, though. We're, we're, those are, I mean, five years. Come on. Who wouldn't save those? Here is another code card. Enjoy the breakthrough if you want them. Another three to the front. Got to keep that in mind on these because they are X and Y. Ursaring, Fisherman. Magneton, I don't know why I couldn't say that. Flabebe, Axew, Scatterbug, Teddy Ursa, Raymaraid. Hey, look at that. It's a reverse Mr. Woo Woo and a Parasect. All right, going on to Guardians Rising. Okay. We're just going to do it this way because it's easier. Here is your code. Enjoy that. So these should be four to the front. And let's go. We got Rip Fairy Energy, Gothitelle, Komala, Rescue Stretcher, Chansey, Trubbish, Machop, Wishy Washy, Reverse Hollow Machop, and a Ligant, like Lilligant. Lilyant. All right, going on to Crimson Invasion. I would say for eight dollars, for under eight dollars, no matter what you're wanting these for, they are worth it. I don't think you're you're gonna find a deal like this for a while. That that is insane. Had I known at the time that they weren't fifteen dollars, I would have picked up. Probably one of each. One, one more of each would have been great. Hakama O, Fighting Memory, Haunter, Spoink, Chimchino, Jigglypuff, Execute, Stuffle. We got a Reverse Magic Carp and a Star Stra, Star Raptor. Star Raptor. Brain no worky. Oh my goodness. Why my brain no work? I don't know why my brain's not working. So we're getting into the last two packs, which are Burning Shadows. Can we get a Rainbow Rare Charizard? If I pull a Rainbow Rare Charizard in one of, in this freaking opening, I will run to the store tomorrow and get more. We got Krilla, Olivia, Lunatone, Cutie Fly, Horsey, Ladybug, Alolan Grimer, Ryulu, 
We got a reverse Viper and a Diancy holographic. Well, it's a holographic, right? Last pack. Can we get that last pack magic? We can't get the last pack opened. <laughs> we got to get that open first before we get a chance at some last pack magic. So here is your code card. Enjoy that for the online. And let's see. Come on, Charizard, Simi Sage, Krilla, Heatmore, Charmander, Oddish, Shock, Porygon, Caterpie, Reverse Alolan Ninetales, and for the last card of this opening, for sure. Ooh, a Lycan Rock. Full Art GX. Ooh, that is a pretty card right there, if I do say so myself. Let's go over the pulls real quick. So we did get the Diancy Holographic, the Tapu Coco, and we got the uh, Mars Shadow Hollow and the Raichu Hollow, which I did not take out of the box. Delphox, Absol, and a Lycanroc GX. So these are very hit and miss, but definitely, definitely worth it. If you see these, pick them up. I'm telling you, do it. You might get something good. But until next video, may Arceus shine upon your poles and have a beautiful day.